When I first heard about this project, to be honest, I thought it was crazy. A surfboard that flew above the water and was wireless and you had a wireless hand controller, it seemed like something out of science fiction. But once you actually thought about it, it all made sense and it actually was possible with today's technology. Every year we're seeing an improvement between 5 and 7% of energy density and power density for batteries. And so you can imagine over a period of a few years, compounded, that ends up in, say, a 30, 40, 50% increase in power. So we could see smaller, lighter batteries that have the same output or larger batteries that allow you to go farther and faster. Well, we're measuring all the temperatures, all the voltages, the current. We're measuring a variety of different signals from some other sensors as well. And we're using that to compile the best state estimate for the battery. And we can use that to optimize estimated lifetime and uh, fuel gauge as well. So it's a software programmable system. So we're actually working on software upgrades as we improve our technology over time. So. For example, even if you bought a battery last year, we're coming up with a new software release that will enable that battery to have new features and more performance in the coming months. So it's one of those products that actually gets better over time. The Lithos Energy is fundamentally about quality. And I think that's really where we, where we differentiate. You know, we care a lot about the quality of each battery pack that we make. With my experience at Tesla and high voltage design and you know, production level high voltage products, it sort of culminated in Lithos Energy being able to ship battery packs that are you know, very capable at the automotive quality level. I personally have worked on a, the fastest uh, street legal electric car in the world. And so that taught me a lot about extreme performance and pushing things to the limit. From that experience, learned some of the best practices about the circuit design, about the battery management system, about the cooling system, about the best way to manage the cells so that even when you're pushing the maximum power that you can out of it, you can do so safely and you can do so reliably. Coming from a background of racing and extreme performance really enabled me to see what's possible with the technology in a way that uh, perhaps other people haven't seen. Um, it's not an industrial background, it's not kind of a old school, move slowly background. We really had to push the limits. We were racing against other teams that were doing innovative things, so we had to come up with all of our best ideas. And so we applied that mindset to this, and I think that enabled us to come up with a really unique product. Through this product, one of the reasons I'm so excited about it is it gives people the feeling of the future. It's clean, it's electric, it's green, it's quiet. Riding the lift foil is an incredible experience, and I think the more people get that experience, the more people have to look forward to, to a battery-powered future. So I'm very excited about that, and happy to be doing my small part to make that happen.